Namaste, and welcome back to Grow with the GN family. I'm Anjali. Hum ache hey, kaise hey up. And today we're going to be reacting to Sabarmati River, the transformation from 2001 to 2012, the lo- blah, blah, blah. The, the world's, world's longest, longest river front. So um, it says down below a little bit about it that it was the most po- polluted and dirty river in the world. People around them used to live in extreme poverty. Gurat government has launched a riverfront project to revive the Sabarmati River and provide houses to all the poor that live near there. That's amazing. Yeah. So we're excited to watch this. We've been doing, we did a few um, travel videos and one about Gurat that was talking about like the new airport mm-hmm. and some of the new buildings. It looked very futuristic and looked amazing. So um, this is, if this is a, a beautiful transformation, then that's even more wonderful because it's good for the environment and the people yeah. and everything. So, all right, Angie, you ready for it? Mm-hmm. Start it up. Wow. So much trash. Yeah. <gasps> oh, oh, wow. That's a lot of trash. So sad to see. Wow. It's a huge death. Yeah. It's beautiful now. Such a difference. Eugene, it's beautiful. It's like a park. Yeah. system for the river. definitely improved so much yeah this is nice that looks like a like a theater like seats right yeah lots of flowers yeah 
makes such a big difference. Wow, that was an amazing transformation. Yeah. Unbelievable, right? Yeah, it's really unbelievable that from 2001 to 2012, they did all of that. Yeah. Like, that's a lot of work. And I bet it took a lot of people that dedicated all those years right. to cleaning that. Yes, and I hear Modi G was the um, inspiration that started it all. But this, yeah, yeah, I can't even imagine how many people it took to see the pictures before um in the in the bottom it said like they had to relocate the people to give them some housing so i hope that was true um that they moved them to a, a nicer place and gave them hopefully a better home than living in the slums by the water like that yeah that was, and that was a lot of trash um but yeah then to clean up all that trash and make that filtration filtration system so <laughs> that it filtered the water better in the dam and then you know, made it all beautiful. And there was like parks and walkways and it looked like um, an outdoor like theater kind of seating mm. and like a stage looked like lots of flowers. Like it became such a nice place for people to go. Like, yeah. The kite festival. I'm sure there was lots of other things that went on down by the waterfront, like just beautiful. So big, big project. Big. But, um, it looks amazing and I hope um, everybody that lives around there is enjoying it um, because it's a huge a huge deal what it went through that transformation it went yeah. through in 11 years it took to make it that beautiful but it looks amazing it was worth um, it yeah now when we watched the Hyderabad video the river daddy was talking about that's in Hyderabad the Musay River is um, was really green and he was saying like you know, they need to clean that up. And this would be like something similar. They should take the inspiration yeah. from, from this river and find a better filtration. Now, it looked more like, um, it didn't look like trash. It looked more like it just needed a really good cleaning. cleaning. Yeah, it looked like it was um, kind of almost sick from itself, not yeah. so much from trash. But it definitely could use a good cleaning and something similar to this. So, you know, KCR might need to get on that. But... This was amazing. So thank you guys for sharing this. We like to watch these kind of videos. Yes. Travel, food. If you haven't checked out some of Anji and my others, we love the food videos. We love the Trump temples and uh, traveling to different states in India. So keep sending them our way. Yes. And don't forget to subscribe. And join our wonderful family. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.